In the week of Gone Farm and Fall premiere, there's a brass Model T touring car. Oh yeah, it has brass on it, all right. We'll talk a little more about that. But the Ford Model T was introduced in October of 1908 as the first affordable mass production car in history. And more than 15 million were built until the Model A was introduced in 1927. The early Model T bodies featured all wood construction with wooden paneling, but in 1911, the first metal skinned wood bodies were introduced and brass was used for the windshield frame, the radiators, the headlamps, the lanterns and trim until 1916. And today, examples of these 10 Lizzie's are referred to as the brass T. David, there was a famous Henry Ford quote that said, you can have a Model T in any color as long as it's black. Well, there were eventually some others, huh? Well, actually, that quote was from later on. In 1911, the early T's, you could get different colors. Uh, this particular one is uh, dark blue. Uh, and they don't call it a brass T for no reason. Every inch of this car has some form of brass on it, from the engine bay to the interior to the exterior. Headlights, radiator, windshield frame, <laughs> it's amazing. Everything, the, even the lamps. Um, you know, the, these brass tees, uh, this has a 177 cubic inch, 20 horsepower, four cylinder engine. Um, Stewart speedometers, uh, wood spoke wheels with the white tires. Um, like you said, first year for the metal skin body. Uh, the really cool thing about this, this car that you never see the owner has a copy of the original build sheet on this car. You're kidding. That is remarkable. Oh, and did we tell the folks it has brass? <laughs> brass from one end to the other. Be sure that you see it at the Beacom Gone Farm and Fall premiere. It's unusual.